grade 8 students today i am going to explain the lesson mass children please observe page 100 and 101 1 gram equals 1000 milligrams 1 kilograms equals 1000 grams 1 ton equal 1000 kilograms the relationship between kilograms and metric ton children 8.756 ton you have to write in kilograms then you have to multiply by 1000 then you can move the decimal place from left to right three places because there are three zeros one two three then your answer will be 8756 kilogram second example three tons and 850 kilograms three tons equals 3000 kilograms plus 850 kilograms 3850 kilograms then 8.756 tons you have to write separately 8 means 8000 kilograms 8 tons 750 kilograms 8 tons 750 kilograms then example 4 three and half tons you have to write in kilograms 3 multiplied by 1000, 3000, then 3000 kilograms, half means 500 kilograms, then 3500 kilograms. Expressing a mass given in kilograms in metric tons, kilograms if you want to convert into tons you have to divide by 1000. 2000 kilograms you divide by 1000 you can omit the zeros then you get 2 tons then 3000 kilograms again you can divide by 1000 then 3 tons turn to page 102 examples 2758 kilograms you have to write in tons you have to divide by thousand you are moving three decimal places backwards right then from right to left one two three then the 2.758 tons then again 2225 kilograms you divide by thousand we're moving three places one two three then the two tons and 225 kilograms then the here three tons and 675 kilograms then you can write 3.675 tons page 102 exercise 9.1 question number one Sub question 1, 2, 3 for classwork. Fourth question I am going to explain. 13 tons and 7 kilograms. 13 when you multiply by 1000, 13,000. Then 7 kilograms when you add 13,007. So you can divide by 1000. Then you are moving 1, 2, 3, then 13.007 tons. Then question number 2, sub question 3 and 4 for classwork. Eighth question I am going to explain. 3 quarter tons, right? 1 ton equal 1000 kilograms. Then 1000 divided by 4 multiplied by 3, then you get 750 kilograms. Then page 103, question number 3, sub question 1, 2 for classwork. 
third question i am going to explain 5.75 you have to write in kilograms then 5.75 multiplied by 1000 then you are moving three decimal places 1 2 3 because you are multiplying by 1000 then the 5750 kilograms question number 6 there is a table please complete the table page 105 addition question number 1 sub question 1 Two, three for class work. Fourth question I am going to explain. One hundred and fifty tons and six hundred and fifty kilograms plus forty tons and four hundred and sixty kilograms. Children, zero plus zero zero. Six plus five eleven balance one. Six plus four ten ten plus one eleven. Year one one five plus four nine one. children you can't write more than 1000 kilograms and remember that the total means you have to add then question number 2 also for class work children now subtraction page 106 Exercise nine point three, question number one, sub question one, two and three for class work. Fourth one I am going to explain children. There are two methods. Ten tons two hundred and fifty kilograms, three tons and seven hundred and fifty kilograms. Here two hundred and fifty you can't subtract seven hundred and fifty, so you have to take one ton one. Ton equal thousand thousand plus two hundred and fifty thousand two hundred and fifty. Then you can subtract seven hundred and fifty. Then your answer will be five hundred. You write this five hundred under kilograms. Here you have already given one. Then nine nine minus three will be six. Then the method two. Ten tons two hundred and fifty kilograms. You can write. Ten point two five zero ton, three tons seven hundred and fifty kilograms, three point seven five zero ton. Then you write. You can when you write the decimal points, you have to wait, consider the decimal points, right? Then when you subtract, your answer will be six point five zero zero. Okay, children. Then next example: sixty tons minus twenty-five tons and hundred and fifty kilograms. Here, tons there are no kilograms. Then you minus twenty-five tons and hundred and fifty kilograms. So when you subtract, your answer will be thirty-four tons and eight hundred and fifty kilograms. Page hundred and six and hundred and eight multiplication. Children, here six tons and five hundred kilograms. You are going to multiply by five. Five times zero zero. Five times zero zero. Five times five twenty five. Balance two. Five times six thirty thirty plus two thirty two. So you can write thirty two tons and five hundred kilograms. children you can't write more than 1000 then exercise 9.4 sub question question number 1 sub question 1 2 3 4 for class work seventh question i'm going to explain 27.3 tons you have to multiply by 25 Twenty-seven point three multiplied by thousand, then you get twenty-seven thousand three hundred kilograms. Then you can multiply by twenty-five double multiplication. First, you multiply by five, then you write zero, then multiply by two, then you add both, then you get 
682,500 kilograms. Then you convert into tons. Then you divide by 1,000. 1, 2, 3. Right? Then your answer will be 682.5 tons. Page 109 and 111, division of mass by a whole number. Exercise 9.5. Question number 1, sub-question 1, 3 and 6 for classwork. Second question I am going to explain. 12, you have to divide by 5. 5 times 2 is 10. Then the balance 2, then you keep a decimal point at 0 for 20. 5 times 4 is 20. 2.4 tons. Then the second method, 12 tons. You can multiply by 1000, then you get 12,000 kilograms. 12,000 kilograms, you can divide by 5. 5 times 2, 10. Balance 2. Take this 0, 5 times 420, then for these zeros there are no 5s, 2400 kilograms, 2400 when you divide by 1000, 1, 2, 3, the moving 3 places, 2.4 tons, you can see the both the answers are same. Okay children, please do all your work.